the Miami Dolphins had been pretty quiet about the Brian Flores allegations but last night Stephen Ross released a statement. Ross's statement categorically denies any wrongdoing and without using the word, liar, calls him basically that. In his release, Ross calls the allegations, false, malicious, and defamatory. He says that he will cooperate with any league investigation. This will become interesting when the investigation progresses and we learn what proof Brian Flores has. If Flores intends to drag this out publicly, we should know what that proof is. Flores maintains that he has eyewitnesses who will back his claims that Ross offered $100,000 per loss in 2019 if Flores would tank and that Ross was not happy when Flores continued to try and win. On Wednesday, ESPN reporter Cameron Wolf said that he spoke to one individual who could verify Flores' claims. Ross spoke of integrity and values in his press release but some are wondering why he waited until late evening to fire off his response. While the NFL says they will investigate the claims, they may be hard to prove if there is something there. Including the allegations of tampering which may require Tom Brady to corroborate the claims made by Flores, something he would not likely do because it would tarnish his brand and image. For Ross, the burden of proof falls on the shoulders of Flores and Ross only needs to defend what Flores can actually provide as proof. If this is simply a case of, he said then there is a situation that Ross will have no problem handling given his much deeper pockets. For now, we can only assume that one of the two is lying but we may never know who that actually is. If Flores' proof is not concrete, we may have a better idea of what is going on but for now, it is literally a wait and see. Ross, however, will likely have to answer some questions of his own to more than just the NFL. He is still trying to find a new head coach.